listen to a story, a story, a story. Come listen to a story. It's story time. Come listen to a story, a story, a story. Come listen to a story. It's story time. Hey, friends. It's T.T. Britton here at Grow With Me Educational Center in Detroit, Michigan. And guess what time it is? It's story time. Today we are reading When God Made You. And this book is by Matthew Paul Turner. And we know that on Wednesdays we kind of focus on learning about the Bible. So we're going to read this book about it. You. No, you. When God made you, God made you all shiny and new. An incredible you. A you all your own. A you like anyone else ever An exclusive design. One that's God refined. You're a perfectly crafted one of a kind. Because guess what? When God made you, somehow God knew that the world needed someone exactly like you. You. No. You. God thinks about you. God was thinking of you long before your big debut. From the very beginning of Amid history and time, you little one, you never left God's mind. God imagined your eyes, your head shape and size, and knew what you looked like when you felt like surprise. God pictured your nose and all ten of your toes. The sound of your voice, God had that composed. The lines on your hands, your hair, every strand. God knew every detail like it was all plain. Out of billions of faces from cultures, all races, people God made from all different places. God knew your name. Your picture is framed. God's family without you would never be the same. Because guess what? When God made you, this much is true. The world got to meet who God already knew. You, you, God sees you. God delights in what is and sees only what's true. That's you, yes, you. In all of your glory, bring color and rhythm and rise to God's story. So, be you, fully you, a show-stopping breath you. Live, live your life in full color, every tint, every hue, discover, explore, have faith, but love you. And learn, and learn, and learn, and relearn all that God made you. You 
use your talents and passion. Those gifts that God fashioned. Think up of ideas and then put them into action. Because God loves you creating your true display when light on the inside through art is portrayed. When you make believe, the stories conceive, the heroics, the magic, those tricks up your sleeve. When you dance alone, spinning like a cyclone, being whoever, whatever, in a world all your own. God smiles and hears why in the spark of your heart. A familiar reflection shines bright from the inside. Because when God made you, <laughs> the world, ooh, and ah, in heaven, they called you an image of God. You. No, you. When God dreams about you, God dreams about all that in you will be true. <laughs> that you, God's you, will be hopeful and kind, a giver who lives with all heart, soul, and mind. <laughs> a dreamer who dreams in big and small things. One who keeps dreaming and journeys upstream. A mover, a shaker, a lover of nature. A builder of bridges, you, the peacemaker. A you who views others as sisters and brothers and lives by three words, love one. A confident you, strong and brave too. You, being you is God's dream 
coming true. Because when God made you, all of heaven was beaming. over you. God was smiling and already dreaming. Hey guys, I really hope that you enjoyed this story and I want you to remember that God made you specifically. He put his hands to work when he created you. So I want you to be the best singer, the best musician, the best dancer, the best joke teller, the best that you can be, whatever it is. Hey, feel free to put it in the comments and tell us what God made you to be. See you soon. Bye.